home video. Now I have a lot of Halloween related videos, things like unboxings, reviews, etc., that I simply cannot wait until October to drop. I know it's only the middle of August, but I'm feeling Halloween. So with this video, I'm kicking off a new series on my channel that I'm calling So for the first Fiending for Halloweening episode on my channel, I have got an unboxing from Trick or Treat Studios. And I have some somber news regarding Trick or Treat Studios. Trick or Treat Studios announced recently that they will no longer be offering Halloween 2 or Halloween 3 related items. They apparently no longer have the licensing to the two Universal Halloween movies. This is kind of sad because Trick or Treat Studios made their name by being the very first company to offer mass produced, high quality Michael Myers masks. And their very first Myers mask was a Halloween 2. I bought one back in the day. I did an unboxing video featuring it. I've proudly displayed it ever since and took it to a convention a few years back to have Dick Warlock sign. I think Trick or Treat Studios will be fine. I just think it sucks they'll no longer be offering Halloween 2 or Halloween 3 related items. Or Chucky slash Child's Play related items either. Maybe things will change in the future. Maybe another company will get the licensing for Halloween 2 and 3 and Child's Play. They still offer all the other Myers masks as well as a plethora of other figures, accessories, and what have you. Inside this box, I have got a Halloween 3 related item, an item that I do believe is already sold out on Trick or Treat Studios' website. This is not one of the masks from Halloween 3. This is not a figure from Halloween 3. This is, well, if you've read the title of this video, you know what this is. So without further ado, let's open it up. There's one. There's two. And open sesame. Oh. Oh, they've got it wrapped up in here like a mummy in all of this, uh, all this paper. Let's see if I can just pull him out. All right, here we go. This is the Halloween 3 musical light up jack-o'-lantern. I'm sorry. It is actually the musical light up jolly jack-o'-lantern. Does that not look like a jolly jack-o'-lantern to you? Cuz he certainly looks he looks very jolly to me. So this guy's pretty cool. He's got that, um, you know, blow mold kind of look about him. There's, um, <laughs> there's the silver shamrock logo on the back. We've got some, <laughs> we've got some snakes and some bugs, uh, crawling around on the back of the jack-o'-lantern too. Um, I wonder if it's, is, is it supposed to look like they're crawling underneath the jack-o'-lantern or did they just not, um, did they decide to just not paint the bugs and the snakes? Uh, I'm, I'm going to say that they're suppo it's supposed to look like that, that the bugs and the snakes are supposed to be crawling underneath um, Jolly Jack. And Jolly Jack comes attached to this cardboard um, display uh, with Halloween 3 on it. Uh, Trigger Treat Studios, Happy Happy Halloween, of course it plays, uh, it features music from the hit film, or so it says there on the box. And let's see, how do I detach it from the box? There's the, there's the Trick or Treaters on the bottom of the box. How do I get it off the, oh. No, oh. okay. So you just pull it out like so, and it's attached 
thusly. There we go. And underneath here we have the little, um, the compartment for uh, the batteries. So here's Jolly Jack, uh, free of his um, display box and got a little bit better view of uh, the creepy crawlies on him. There's a centipede crawling around the bottom. A couple of centipedes crawling around the bottom of old Jolly Jack. And uh, down here on the bottom, you've got the compartment for the batteries. I'm gonna assume batteries are not included. No, batteries are not included. And, uh, what's it? Is it triple A, double A? Three double A batteries. So we'll hold off on the batteries for now. Let's just take a good close look at Jolly Jack here. And we can see a little bit better view of all the creepy crawlies on his back. He's got a couple of uh, centipedes crawling around on him. That would be very uncomfortable. Again, he's got that classic old school kind of blow mold design about him, which I think is, is cool. He's a decent size. He's a, uh, 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 he's, he's not super heavy, but, um, here's his green, uh, stem or whatever it is on the top of the top of his head. So that's pretty much all there is to, uh, good old Jolly Jack here. He's, uh, He's, he's pretty cool. I like that Halloween three jack-o'-lantern, uh, look about him. Um, the, the creepy crawlies on the back. I mean, I, I probably, eh, you know, I could do with or without them, to be honest. I, the, the, the silver shamrock logo is cool though. Um, yeah, I mean, he's just a, he's a cool, he's a cool little decoration. And I'll give them credit. There's some, some fine detail in here uh, on the surface of uh, old Jack to make him look uh, more jack-o'-lantern-y, more pumpkin-y. Instead of it just being a very smooth, uh, non-textured uh, thing, they took the extra step to, to add that texture in and, uh, and again, make him look more jack-o'-lantern-y, more pumpkin-y. And you know, the more I'm hanging out with old Jolly Jack, the more jolly I'm feeling myself. So, I, you know, I'm getting into the Halloween spirit. Jolly Jack is helping me get into the Halloween spirit. Thank you, Jolly Jack. All right, so I've unscrewed Jolly Jack's bottom and got some batteries. So let's try, let's try old Jolly Jack out. Let's see how Jolly, Jolly Jack really is. Uh, here we go. All right, so I guess he just plays the happy, happy Halloween uh, thing over and over again. Let's see, what if I, okay. So if you, there's also the option of just having Jolly Jack's Jolly Light on. And let me turn this off. There we go. There's Jolly Jack all lit up. No sound, just the lights. There's the back of him. Yeah, old Jolly Jack. Lit up. Not bad. It's pretty, pretty, uh, pretty strong. Lights. Let's let's do let's do this with the lights off. So there you go, the Jolly Jack Halloween 3 
musical jack-o'-lantern from Trick or Treat Studios, um, or I guess formerly from Trick or Treat Studios, now that they're all sold out and um, now that uh, Trick or Treat Studios will no longer be offering Halloween 2 and Halloween 3 related items. I guess this is this is probably uh, already a, a, a highly sought after collectible um So let me know your thoughts on the Trick or Treat Studios, Jolly Jack, Musical, Halloween 3, Jack-O-Lantern down in the comments section below. Also, let me know your thoughts on uh, Trick or Treat Studios losing their Universal license as well. Are you sad that they'll no longer be offering Halloween 2 and 3 and Child's Play slash Chucky items? Let me know down in the comments section below. If you like this video, please leave it a thumbs up and share it on social media. If you're not following me on social media, those links are in the description. As always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Take care. And until next time. A huge thank you to all my patrons and channel members for your generosity and support. Become a patron today and get early access to videos, have a say in what content appears on my channel, join me for monthly live streams, exclusive watch parties, and more. Become a channel member today and get access to exclusive badges and emotes to use when I stream, as well as members-only watch parties. Both those links are in the description. Say hello to the internet, Jeremy. Hello to the internet.